Hi guys, welcome back to another law show and in this video I'll be explaining to you the different types of law firms. So starting off I'll talk about the Magic Circle law firm. So these are the top law firms in the UK. They are mainly London based as well. They may have some offices elsewhere like Manchester or I don't know Newcastle but um, these are the top law firms. They are highly specialized. They have um, quite a lot of partners as well so they're relatively big and they have quite, an uh, quite a strong international influence as well. The next type of law firm that I'll talk about are international law firms. So these are uh, law firms with head offices either in the UK or the US. Um, it usually ranges between those. So if it's in the UK, it'll usually be London, their head office. And if it's the US, it'll be wherever it may be in uh, the United States of America. So um, these usually have high salaries. They also take on quite a lot of trainees, just like Magic, law, uh, Magic Circle law firms. And uh, yeah, they have a very strong international influence um, and they also deal with quite complex international law cases because oh, you can imagine uh, the types of laws they kind of have to um, contradict with each other and face. So it will be one country versus another usually. So these are the cases they'll um, work on. The third type of law firm that I'll talk about is national law firms. Um, so these are uh, law firms with a lot of offices up and down the UK. So they'll obviously have one in London, um, cities like Manchester, uh, Leeds, Liverpool maybe, uh, Newcastle as well, Birmingham as well. So all of these cities will probably have an office in for these national law firms. They're also usually um, what's known as full service law firms. So they'll offer a lot of services in a lot of different branches. They'll have solicitors and um, members within all of these, uh, specialized within all of these different branches of law. So um, they take on some trainees as well per year, but nowhere near as many as full, um, what is it, magic circle law firms, even um, international law firms may take on more solicitors, or more trainees rather, um, per year. The final types of law firms that I'll cover in this video are high street and also regional law firms. So high street and regional are fairly similar um, in that they both operate on private clients and also you know local businesses and things like that. So let's say you see um, a law firm on any street pretty much and it doesn't have any branches elsewhere that would be known as a high street law firm uh, they don't usually take on trainees they may take on one to maybe five trainees per year but usually they won't take on any trainees they'll just kind of hire solicitors as well they'll operate as I mentioned before for private clients so let's say you have a private matter you probably go to them first um, and yeah that's um, and then regional law firms are the bigger version if you will um, they may have a few offices within the region or um, perhaps like a wider reach than the high street law firms so that's all I'll be covering this law show. Obviously, there's a few more types of law firms as well you can research, but those are kind of the main types of law firms that you'll come across um, during your studies and also things you'll be applying for. Uh, thank you so much for watching this video and hopefully I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.